What? You mean the French don't dress like this? Hi guys, it's Gloria, and today we're talking about French style. Well, obviously I'm not French, but I've always loved the elegance, the effortlessness, and the overall less is more mindset. I talk about slow fashion a lot on my channel, and I feel like the idea of French style is very similar to what I personally believe in. French women are not obsessed with trends, they value quality over quantity, they invest in the classics and wear them on repeat, and most importantly, they have the confidence that goes with it. But I know talking about mindset is kind of vague, so in this video, I am going to analyze some actual outfits that the French it girls are wearing in summer, and I'll try to recreate these outfits with what I already have in my closet. Oh, by the way, in case you haven't noticed, I did my hair for this video because my natural hair is too damn straight for that French effortless look. I put so much effort into it, and I swear to god, it was curly. Not anymore. If there's one thing I notice about French women is that they practically live in their jeans. This is a new pair of jeans that I just got from Evelyn, which actually comes in handy. As for the top, I don't have anything that's similar to hers, so I chose a short sleeve white linen blouse, and I'll roll up the sleeves to emulate that look. As for the shoes, I'm just gonna improvise and wear these nude sling bags. I also put on a pair of gold hoop earrings and a gold necklace. The most important thing about this outfit is the pop of red that she added by carrying a burgundy bag. This burgundy bag was gifted to me by Le Présent. I really like it, I think it's very chic. And voila, I'm Frenchified. I see French girls wearing knits a lot, even in summer, and it's no different when it comes to tank tops. Well, 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 I happen to have a knit tank top that looks exactly like hers, and surprise, surprise, she's pairing it with, you guessed it, a pair of blue jeans. It's kind of funny to have something that similar, but I don't have that spectacular Parisian architecture just outside my balcony. Anyway, since I can't see her shoes, I'll pair this outfit with my dainty black heel sandals. And learning from the previous outfit, I'll complete the look with a burgundy bag as well. Now I'm ready to walk down the streets of Paris, in my imagination. French girls have a love affair with florals. I picked this picture in particular because the closest thing I have to florals is polka dot. She's wearing her signature rouge top, while well, I'll just go with my polka dot wrap blouse. It's the closest thing I have. She's also wearing a pair of dark blue wide leg jeans, and since I don't have any of those, I'm pairing this with my dark blue skinny jeans. As for the shoes, I don't have Esper Joe's either, so I'll wear my nude sling bags instead. And of course, I'll put on a pair of cat eye sunglasses. Lastly, I'll carry a wicker basket because apparently that's what all the cool French girls do, at least according to Instagram. Now I'm ready to go pick some strawberries or mushrooms or whatever. I see French girls wearing these romantic little white tops a lot, the milkmaid tops. You know the kind I'm talking about. I have this white milkmaid top that I've been loving recently. I call it my French top, wee oui, wee. Oui. And of course, I'm wearing the French girl staple, a pair of blue jeans, although mine are straight leg and hers are white leg, but let's pretend I didn't notice the difference. Now I have to improvise. I'm pairing this outfit with my black heel sandals, and since I wanna be like one of those cool French girls, I'll carry my wicker basket too. And there you go, this is as French as I can be. When French women are not wearing their blue jeans, they are wearing their white jeans. For this casual French look, I put on a black t-shirt. I'm sure we all have those in our closets. I also put on a pair of white skinny jeans, although I do need to roll up my jeans to get that similar cropped effect. She's pairing this outfit with her two-tone ballet flats, so of course I'll put on my sling bags to emulate that look. And finally, I'll carry a soft straw bag as well. Her bag looks so much more presentable in the city, but this is the only similar thing I've got, so we'll have to roll with it. Friends, 
French girls do wear Breton shirts, just not like how I wore it in the intro. Of course, I put on my good old Breton shirt and I'll pair it with my dark blue skinny jeans. Now it's time to improvise since I can't see the rest of what she's wearing. I'll go with a pair of black loafers. These are actually my driving shoes, but now they've been upgraded to appear in my style video. I'll also carry this black bag because I heard French women like running around with a bag that they can stuff everything in. So here you go, a perfect outfit for running errands, the French way. Now it's time for dresses. A clean white dress will also be something that the French girls love to wear. I was very surprised to see a dress so similar to mine, so of course I had to put this in here. The sweetheart neckline, the puff sleeves, and the slit design just makes everything so French. She's wearing her dress with an oversized black blazer, but it's hot right now, so we'll forget about it. As for the shoes, she's wearing a pair of nude slides. I don't have those, so I'll wear my nude slingbacks again. I'll also pair this outfit with a pair of cat eye sunglasses. And lastly, I'll finish the look with my burgundy handbag. Ooh la la, I feel so chic. Sorry, I had to say this phrase once in this video. French girls love their floral tops, and of course they love their floral slip dresses too. Lucky for me, I do have a floral dress with actual flowers on it. The delicate spaghetti straps and the tie details at the front are very similar to the dress she's wearing in the photo. She's wearing the dress with nude slides, but I'll go with my black heel sandals instead. She's also carrying a white bag, so I'll carry my white bag as well. Now I just need some sort of fence so that I can flip my hair around like she does. Another one of French women's favorites are wrap dresses. It's no surprise since it's universally flattering. And of course, I had to choose a polka dot one because I only seem to buy blacks and whites and polka dots and polka dots also happen to be black and white. Anyway, I don't have a black polka dot wrap dress, but I do have a white one. I'm pairing this dress with my black heel sandals. I know she's got a wine glass in her hand, but if you know me, I don't drink and I don't even have glasses at my place. But wait, I do have an empty vase. Okay, I cheated for this one because she's actually not wearing a black slip dress in the photo, she's wearing a slip skirt. But I think the dress is more versatile because you can wear it as a skirt as well. I'm wearing my broken silk slip dress again because the length is very similar to hers. Yes, I still don't know what to do with this dress. I'll also put on a white linen shirt and tie it at the front. I'm pairing this outfit with these black heels with straps, and lastly, I'll carry a wicker basket. I'm not gonna tie my hair up because it's gonna ruin my effortless hairstyle that I put so much effort into. And that's it! I would say I look quite elegant aside from the fact that I'm wearing a broken dress. Does anyone want a baguette? I don't even eat bread. Oh. Ah. <laughs> 